I'm still tripping off the URL now. Bought Norb's back. Fat, funky, nasty, sticky, taffy apple underwear, messer up or wearing, 13 sandwiches, loaf of bread, pulling, fish stick eating, sour, sour spit, nasty, coleslaw eating, funky cow biter. <laughs> <laughs> he a real cow biter. I saw that brother on the farm. <laughs> he wait for the farmer to go to sleep. <laughs> Wake up. <laughs> you know, cow sleep standing up. <laughs> he did do. Snuck up behind the cow and bit the cow on the hind side. Like, a little bit below the ass part. <laughs> like... <laughs> That's a nasty, big, funky dude, man. I can't stand Norbs, man. That dude is a flunky. And I can't stand him because he a dirty dude. He been dirty his whole career. Just being wrong to people, man. Just sabotaging people and just trying to mess over up-and-coming battle rappers who trying to just get a chance to just showcase their talent and make it. I can't stand dudes like him, man. A straight-up trick, man. He is a straight-up trick. Ooh, I can't stand dudes like him, man. And then he that dirty, you'll figure he'll know how to fight. This coward can't even fight and sitting up here trying to just sabotage people and do stupid stuff on a URL name like he just going to keep getting away with it. That's why that little seventeen year old dude hit him in the mouth. Hit that bit that dude like five hundred pounds and can't even fight. All that weight and he don't even know how to use it. Like get up out of here, man. Twerk hit that dude in the gut. He dookied on himself in a jargon suit. He dookied on himself in a jargon suit. Some people said that came from Twerk hitting him. That's why no, that I, that's a lie. That stuff been in that jargon suit. That dookie been in that jargon suit. Twerk ain't hit him and he dookied on himself. I'm not giving Twerk no credit like that. That been dookie. He, twerk, twerk just ain't never got close up on him like that to actually smell it. That's all that was, man. Now, I would say this. The vomit the vomit part probably came from Twerk when Norbs vomit because when Twerk picked him up and squeezed him, all that, all that food. He eats so much, the food just, it's still digesting. He still got food digesting for like 15 years ago. Like, it's still digesting because he, he, he cram it. Like, he, he plunge, he plunge the food in his mouth. Like, <laughs> I had to stand on his shoulders and make him vomit because he was choking. I had to. Plunge, plunge the food up out of his, him. <laughs> it's a dirty dude, man. Something wrong with him. I think he got a sickness or something. Cause his forehead, his forehead look like it's it's price tag, like like it's Walmart price tag, like a price check. It got it's he light skinned it. He light skinned it like an infant, but. His forehead, his forehead like it's like a club bracelet. <laughs> you know when you go to the club, you pay to get in, they mark you so they, so they know you've been in there so you can keep coming in and out. That's how his forehead is. It's club. It's club mark. He got the mark of cane on his forehead. Like, that's a sorry dude, man. That's a straight up trick, man. I can't stand that dude, man. That dude is a born sore loser. I can't stand him, man. I really can't. It's hard even listening to his radio show. He sound like he need a medic. You be I've tried to listen to that man's show, the Norbs with All podcast. I'm trying to listen to that show, and you know I wear headphones all the time, y'all. When I'm uh listening to the internet and doing this stuff, I be wearing my headphones. This dude sitting on there. Oh, it sounds so crazy. It sounds like it sounds like the dude from um Everybody Hates Chris. The black dude on Everybody Hates Chris. That's what it sounds like. You know what? And he and he's so boring. He be like So y'all uh 
Look, we got a uh, chess, chess, chess coming in, and um, you know, I really I, I like this guy. Uh, you know, he would cake life. Um, when I saw the little dude, uh, I thought that um, he's a phenomenal battle rapper. And as a phenomenal battle rapper, he choked a lot, but I really believe that <laughs> this nigga done hibernated on air, man. <laughs> Dump him off in that damn cave. Dump him off in the cave with Rock them. Let Rock them molest them. Let, let Rock them <laughs> finger pop him. <laughs> Drop him off in that damn cave. Man, something wrong with that dude, man. Ooh, wee, man. That brother's, that brother's sad. <laughs> I like the Patreon. Man, that brother sad as hell, man. Something wrong with you. Sitting there. Your drawers look like you slid down a chocolate slide. All the all the number two in the front part. How you get the, the number two in the front part? Like where the private part at? How did how did Dookie get to that from the back to the front? Like, you that's a trifling nigga, man. <laughs> you will you tallest dude, tallest dude messer upper. You know them guys that big like that, they be messing up the tallest dude. Like <laughs> they oh he he he'll mess a tree up. You he, he'll mess a tree up. Ooh we you better ever go camping. <laughs> he'll mess a tree up. That dude got problems, man. I can't stand that wildebeest. I can't stand that elephant. <laughs> I can't stand that elephant. Soft as hell. Turk was hitting and kicking him. He said, hold on. What are you doing, Turk? What are you doing, Turk? <laughs> None of that stuff wasn't hurting. He was so calm talking to Twerk while Twerk jumping on him. He was like, wait, what are we doing, Twerk? Can I get up and let me just get up and explain. All I do, beating him up, roughing him up like, dude, sorry, man. How you work 12 years for one company in? I ain't got nothing to show for it, like nothing, man. And this loser called Jazz the rapper father on her. If that's not a loser, what is? This dude actually called Jazz the rapper father on her for messing around with another dude. Like, dude is a loser, man. I'm talking about this dude is a real live loser. Real live loser, man. Get up out of here, man. Oh, my gosh. He's sorry, man. He is real, real sorry. Now, he... <laughs> he's begging the hell out of the URL. Now, he talking about, Hey, I'm back, y'all. Who want to help me? Who want to help me with my radio show? Nobody. Don't nobody care. That weak radio show. Nobody cares, man. It ain't even a real show, man. Get up out of here, man. That dude is a loser, man. Now that's one guy, man, who could have just stayed gone. I, I'm, I'm keeping it real. He could have just stayed gone, man. Dude, horrible, man. Anyway, shouts out to everybody that's on the Patreon. It's your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment. That's a question. It's yours.